Hi, this is Stephanie from the Edgewater Design Group. This video is going to feature information about the different phases of the design process. Whether you are renovating, adding an addition, or starting a new project, your project will be guided through several phases of design. The first part of the process is called pre-design. During pre-design, we gather information from you about your project. We discuss the building site, your budget, and the project program. After pre-design, the schematic design phase begins. The schematic or conceptual design is developed by one of our designers. This includes floor plans and 3D massing for the project. This is the big picture portion of the project that marries our creative skills with your specific needs. The design development phase follows the schematic design phase. This phase flushes out some of the specifics of a project. The floor plans are developed further and building sections are developed. Elevations and exterior perspectives are also shown. Before beginning the last phase of design, we like to be certain that there will be few or ideally no additional changes to a project. The final design phase is the construction documents. This phase incorporates all of the detail and engineering needed to build a project. Foundation and framing plans are developed. We believe that a thorough set of construction drawings is the best service to our clients. It's important to remember that design is a process. The first concept of the design might take a few iterations. There will be some tweaks and modifications along the way. In the end, we strive to work as efficiently as possible to be good stewards of our clients' money. Our team of designers, our architect, and our engineer are dedicated to a fun and efficient design process. 